Plea negotiations are confidential, and as part of that confidentiality, statements made during plea negotiations or evidence of offers made are not admissible in criminal or civil cases. Now, the reason that this rule exists, at least for criminal cases, is to encourage prosecutors and defendants to engage in plea negotiations by not chilling those negotiations with the threat that plea negotiations will be used at trial to show that a defendant had some kind of consciousness of guilt by engaging in those negotiations. The corollary to that is that they also exist to protect prosecutors at trial by not allowing evidence of offers made by the prosecution to be used at trial to argue that the prosecution lacks some kind of confidence in the strength of their case. Over 90% of criminal cases in this country are resolved through the process of plea negotiations and this confidentiality surrounding those negotiations is a big part of why that's able to exist.